do you want your eggplant calendar? Uh. <gasps> That's it. It is a... I'm not sure what it is. <laughs> and it's gone! Good morning everybody, welcome to Vlogmas Day 15. I've just realised I always say good morning but I upload these videos at 9 o'clock at night. So shouldn't I technically be saying good evening? Or good afternoon? I know it would be good evening, wouldn't it? Um, Naomi's had her calendar. Um, put a nice wax melt on. <coughs> Naomi's having some raisins, aren't you, baby? You've made a mess. <coughs> Is it all gone? It's all gone all over the floor. And your little puff thing. So I was just talking to you guys, doing the introduction that I do like. Hello, welcome to this day, blah, blah, blah. And I just got a delivery. I was about to show you the box and I was like, that's not a smart idea. So, ah, um, first of all, if you saw yesterday, my wrapping is terrible. And I kept complaining to Josh, because I'm left-handed and we have right-handed scissors. So he's actually ordered me some left-handed scissors. So thank you, Joshua. Then, ordered some card, some washable Crayola paints, I don't know if that's, there we go, some paint cover thing for the table, and a paint palette. Basically, what we're going to do is, um, we're going to be like making little like decoration things. I watch, if you don't know who Chris and Eve are, I will link their channel in the description below. They, I just love watching them. They've got two, I think it's British short hair cats, and they have a little girl named Rose who's only five days younger than Naomi. It's crazy. Um, they're just so lovely. And um, this uh, last year they made like cards with Rose's feet on. And they made them like into mistletoes. This year they're using our hand to make Christmas trees. I thought that was a great idea, but instead of making it for cards, since I've already got all the Christmas cards and wrote them out, that we'd make them and try and turn them into little like decorations for the trees, so, like cut them out, try and put a string through them and tie them onto the tree. So that's gonna be a very fun activity later when Kane gets home. So yeah, I'm very excited about this. And this will be Naomi's first time painting as well. Okay, so I thought I'd show you like how big the tubs are and all the colours. Because it's different seeing a picture of them to actually seeing them. So we got red. Now these are very tiny. Oh, would you like the box? So we got red. We got green. We have blue. Although it looks a bit purple on the camera, but it is blue, and this is purple. There we go, yeah, you can see the difference now. And then yellow and orange. And then these paint palette things, there's, three, there's a pack of three, I didn't even notice that. And then with the card, there is 50 sheets, so... Because Josh was saying, have you got enough in case stuff goes wrong? And I'm like, we've got 50 sheets. He's like, oh, you've got plenty. Oh, Naomi wants to show you. Are you showing everybody? <laughs> You're so sweet. And the green. The green and the orange. You're very happy, girl. It's paint. Can you say paint? I haven't got a clue what I know. Paint. Tune. 
Are you gonna dance? You guys saw me clean this room yesterday. Now it's got yogurt rays. Well, we call them yogurt raisins. And they're just all over the floor. Kane's face mask. A box of roses. And Naomi's little puff snack things. Yep, and the paint palette, yeah. Ah, oh, thank you. So, I don't know about other children, but like my kids love fruit. And Naomi is mad about blueberries and strawberries. So, as like a little healthy snack for her, I just cut her up some strawberries. You love strawberries, don't you? Can you say strawberries? For strawberries, she goes, bees. And then blueberries, she goes, blueberries. She's so impatient with it as well. I'll be there cutting them and she's there at my leg. Ah, ah, so I have to give her one. Well, I'm still cutting the rest. I'm there watching her and cutting at the same time. Yeah, um, let's see what time it is. It's quarter past two, so, um, in about half an hour or so, we're going to be going to set off to get Kane from school and then come back and do the little Christmas crafting. I'm really excited for it because this is like Naomi's first time with anything to do with painting and it's, Kane's first time doing painting at home because we've never really had any painting, any paints or anything like that. So I'm really excited and like their their reaction. Okay, so if you can't hear me very well, I've got my washer on. Me and Naomi are gonna have some yogurts, and I'm gonna put the painting cover on the table. I'm gonna get everything sorted, and then we're gonna go pick Kane up. Night, he climbed down the chimney at the speed of light. While we're dancing around the Christmas tree Hugging and kissing just you and me Carolers are singing outside our door Lovely songs we all heard before As they walk from house to house To wish us all a... So that's um, that all set up. Naomi thought it a yogurt would be better all over her clothes instead of in her belly. So, just had to clean her up with some baby wipes. Your Christ the Christmas tree, I know. And I don't know what it is with her. Sometimes she will completely scoff all of the yogurt. And then other times, that's gingy. And then other times, she has a few bits and then she's like, nah, I've had enough. Right now she's looking at the Christmas tree. But anyway, we're gonna go get ready now and pick Kane up. I'm just hoping that it's not going to be muddy because like the bit that we walk through to get to Kane's school from our street is like a track bit and when it rains it gets really boggy because it's not an actual path, it's just like mud so my shoes are very mucky, they really need cleaning and I'm just hoping today it's not boggy it hasn't been raining all day which is good isn't it? Yeah, I'm gonna go get Kane now. Kane, come into the kitchen. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> you don't even know. Do you know what it all is? No, what is it? <laughs> it says thanks. We're gonna yeah. make some Christmas crafts again. But this time, yeah. we're gonna use paint <laughs> in our hand. Are you having fun making that noise, Naomi? This. Are you excited? Yeah. Can we do it right now? Please, please, please. Yes, yes, yes. Just wait a minute then. Just busy saying ho, ho, ho. We're 
feeling jolly eating Christmas cake. And then we go skating on the frozen lake, saying hi to every friendly face. And later we warm up by the fireplace. Well, that ended in a bit of a disaster because Naomi started eating her fingers. Well, trying to lick the paint off her fingers. So I had to rush to get her all cleaned up. But they're all clean now. Both of them. We just got to wait for them to dry and then I'll like do the doodles on them to make them look like Christmas trees. And then I'll show you. Did you have a good day at school? Yeah. That's good. Oh. Are you excited for tomorrow because you've got your Christmas pantomime tomorrow? What? Well, it's virtual. A virtual Christmas pantomime, so they just sit and watch it. And there was something else as well, I can't really remember what it is. But um, we're going to chill for a bit now until the paint's dry. Then after I've done the doodles and showed you, we're probably going to have some tea. Then that's going to be their bath and then bed. So, um, while Kane was in the living room, well, he's watching Christmas Chronicles too. Well, they both were meant to be, but <coughs> Naomi's came in to join me. Um, I went to check on the uh, paintings and they dried. So I picked two. So, like, the best one of Kane's and the best one of Naomi's. And I'll just show you. So here they are. This one, obviously, you can tell it's Kane's. So I just made it into a little Christmas tree and I think it's absolutely adorable. Baby. And then Naomi's little hand is so cute with her little fingers. And the size difference between their hands is going to be so crazy. But yeah, I'm really happy with how it turned out. I was really worried about the stars because I'm not good at drawing stars. But um, Naomi's came out a bit funny and Kane's star came out alright. <laughs> But they came out a lot better than I thought they would, the stars. And I'm just really happy with how it turned out. So I'm going to cut them up. Um, I don't know how I'm going to put holes through them though. Because I don't have like a, a hole puncher thing, if you know what I mean. So that might be a trip to the shopping centre tomorrow or somewhere that sells hole punchers. Um, I don't even know if we have any string either, so might, that might be another thing. I do need to get some string, because Kane came home the other day with a Christmas card from school. So I can imagine soon, oh this week he's going to be getting them all, and we'll need somewhere to put them. So we need to hang some string on a wall in the living room and put them on there. Also, this is a great time for me to use these left-handed scissors that Josh had ordered for me. So there we go, I've left, I've cut them out, I'm not amazing at cutting, as you can see. I've left a little bit at the top, you know, I'd like to be able to punch the hole through. I'm really excited, I'm really, I'm really happy with how these have turned out. So I'm going to put these to one side, so obviously little hands cannot get a hold of them and rip them, because we don't want that, do we? And then tomorrow, we'll go out and get a hole puncher and some string. She's trying to get to them. You're trying your best, aren't you? Because your cheeky monkey is in a bit of a mischievous mood today, aren't you? Yeah. Oh, I get a nice cuddle. Oh. Oh, in case anyone was wondering, Naomi's legs are completely fine now. Still a bit red, but um, they don't hurt anymore. Like, after I got her out of the bath last night, I was putting her lotion on her legs. She didn't flinch or anything. And she's fell over and all sorts, and she's completely fine now, aren't you? 
She hasn't had cow pole for a few days now, I think. <laughs> this took a turn, basically. I was filming, like, saying, oh, they've had the tea and stuff like that, and Naomi was walking into her bedroom. We were walking into Naomi's bedroom, and she, she was walking with her drum, and she fell with it, and she's basically cut her tongue open. And there was a lot of blood. She was in absolute... She was sobbing. And I didn't know where the blood were coming from because there was that much of it. But now she's calmed down and it stopped bleeding. She, she's cut her tongue open. Nay, nay, can you stick your tongue out? Can you go, eh? Uh, I don't know if you can see there, that dark bit. But, eh, uh, yeah. Oh, don't worry. you don't need to rub your tongue. It's okay. What, 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 what? We need it on. You're going to have a bath. So, yeah. A lot of blood on her. A little bit of blood on me. Can you stick your tongue out? <gasps> yeah, you can. Oh, yeah, she's, she's showing you all. Luckily, the tongue heals very quickly. So, we're just going to have to keep an eye on her now for the next few days. Oh, darling. <laughs> Yeah, anyway, Naomi's gonna have a bath now. And now that all that's calmed down. Right, okay, so um, both the kids have had their baths and Kane's in bed and I'm about to go make Naomi's bottle. I think I'm gonna leave this one here because there really isn't anything else to say. So, um, thank you for watching. Please subscribe, comment and like. I was gonna do a comment of the day, but Naomi has locked my iPhone again iPhone is disabled for five minutes. Uh, you did that, bye. yes. Naomi, do you want to say bye-bye? Bye-bye. You're so sweet. She She's completely fine and that. And the swelling's gone down already. It's just a little cut now and a little bit swollen. So I'm going to have to be careful with her over the next few days and keep an eye on it, make sure it's healing properly. Okay, so I'm just logging in on, my, on mine and Josh's laptop to get the comment of the day. It's from someone called Simply Ashley Lynn and she put the, she is adorable. My toddler goes underneath the tree to see all the decorations, lol. Love vlogs, new friend here. <coughs> yes, I don't know if you've heard me mention before but the bottom of my Christmas tree is very bare now because of Naomi pulling all the decorations from off from the bottom. Okay, I will, yes. So yeah, I'll link her channel down below for you. I've got to go now because Naomi wants me to read a story to him because I'm not reading it. She's getting a bit upset. So, do you want me to read Wonderful Weather? Yeah. Say please. Right, go get it then. Also, follow me on Instagram and uh, thank you for watching. Bye. Do you want to say bye-bye? Yeah. Say bye-bye. Bye-bye. Good girl.